Police say on Saturday morning, five people were taken to the hospital suffering from non fatal overdoses of K2. They were found on the same intersection of Broadway in Bedford Stuyvesant, Brooklyn, where local leaders account for more than 100 K2 overdoses over the last two years. These are some of the frightening images from July of 2016 at the intersection of Broadway and Myrtle, where police found dozens of people strung out on K2, synthetic marijuana, also known as spice. Victims slumped over on the sidewalk with blank stares, some barely standing, others strapped onto stretchers. In May of this year, police set up a mobile command station at the intersection to try to curb the problem. Today, that station is gone, but locals say K2 and its users are still here. They're falling out all in the street. By here, they were laying on their back. So we were just pulling them to the side. It's still a problem then? Yeah, it's a big problem over here. Police say over the last couple of years, they have made more than a dozen arrests for the illegal street sale of K2. Several city officials will make a major announcement about a crackdown on the epidemic here in this neighborhood. Coming up later this afternoon, we of course will be there and have the latest on CBS 2 News at 5 o'clock. We're live in Bedford Stuyvesant, Brooklyn. Hazel Sanchez, CBS 2 News.